how to learn to day trade for a living fast. And what if I told you that all you need is one working strategy to make a living, okay? And now some of you will tell Andrew, you, you're crazy, you know, you should learn all the trading strategies you know to make a living. Or you should always invest in a blue chip stocks or invest in Bitcoin. Meh, that's how you make a living. No, it's not. Yes, you can make money from all of those things if you know what you're doing and if you have resources. But what if you don't know what you are doing and you don't have the resources? I mean, the more strategies you will try to learn, okay, you will become, you know, less motivated and because there will be too much challenge. That's why it's quality over quantity, not quantity over quality. It's best to pick a couple of working training strategies that works for you. It may not work for everybody, but let's just jump into this topic of how we can do this fast. If you're a newbie trader, if you never traded before, but you're willing to leave your job or you have left your job and you are left to your own devices. This is exactly what I'm going to you know, explain you here right now. I'm actually going to tell you exactly how to do it in two weeks. Okay. So let's make sure make sure you watch this video until the end click that subscribe button if you're new and let's dig in okay one of the main reasons why I'm making video on this topic is because first of all I have so many people you know asking me the same question over and over again how to become profitable trader fast and more and the second reason is you know because of this yeah, situation we have now in Europe which is very very uncertain and so many people have left their jobs you know in East Europe because of what's happening okay and this might help you because I'm sure so two weeks right learn these things in two weeks if you want to become a profitable trader and you be if you want to trade for living fast okay it's actually only 12 days but I spread it in two weeks so in two weeks you need to learn about these things again you don't need to be professional in these things you need to learn how they work and you need to learn what works for you <laughs> support resistance lines support resistance lines are the most important lines you need to understand how to identify them on a charts simply to learn about you know uh, how to play support resistance lines make sure that you always use larger time frames such as daily or four hour time frame and see where the price touched the same level at least three to four times here we can see that the USD CAD touched this level once, twice, three, four times, actually five times. So what does it mean? It means that this line is or resistance line. Once that's broken, it becomes support. Now, if you don't know what you are doing, okay, don't worry, okay, delete all of this. There are other free tools which will help you to identify support resistance. For example, moving averages or Fibonacci retracement. I have made videos about that on my channel, so check it out or email me if you need like a specific, you know, assistance. Now the second point, the second day, perfect placing, you know, uh, make sure that you learn how to place the trend lines accurately, okay? So learn about trend lines, okay? Uh, follow, as you know, trend is your friend. If you follow the trend and place the trades with the trend, that you know, you know, will be more and more secure in your trades. Third, study candlestick patterns, okay? Study candlestick patterns, how the candlesticks work and what candlestick, uh, candlesticks actually mean, okay? So learn about them. Again, you don't need to be you know, uh, genius about it, okay, and re read hundred of books. No, simply read about uh, different candlesticks. There are not that many candlesticks, okay? There is a quite a good list, okay? But learn about what they mean when they are formed and closed. So whenever candlestick closes, it means something. For example, here, the price went up here and went back, you know, went up. What does it mean regarding candlesticks? It means that, look at this, okay? This red candle closed, then the new candle opened, the green candle. This was the reversal candle. Look how beautifully it was, this candle right here. Look how it was pushed from the bottom up. This candlestick is on daily chart representing that the trend, this downtrend is finished. It means that the price is gonna go up. It, it did finish, it you know waited for several days and then it went up. Why? Because this candlestick told us so. So it's very, very important. So next day, what you should, day number four, review chart patterns, uh, okay. And then day number five, practice placing Fibonacci retracements. Practice Fibonacci retracements together with your support resistance, okay? I will do that the same day. So you can save your time if you really want to need to make money fast. 
That's what I'm trying to explain you here. Yes, it's possible to become profitable trader fast, but you need to learn these things. Not that many, just 12 things. Not 100 things, just 12. Number six, is a day number six. Uh, learn about moving averages. So learn about exponential moving averages and uh, simple moving averages. Uh, I use several moving averages and I have showed you several different great profitable trading uh, strategies that works by using moving averages alone. Seven day master market structure. They, okay, so market structure again depends what you trade. What are you, wanted, what are you trading? Forex, stocks, commodities, cryptocurrencies. So master the structure of the market. Uh, number so day number eight watch videos on momentum oscillators watch my videos on momentum oscillators i should say day number nine okay learn about divergence learn about the different divergences this is divergence is when uh, is with the rsi so go to indicators click on the relative strength index or simply rsi uh, and whenever the rsi shows down but the candlestick shows up that means it's a divergence. Let me show you in with the actual RSI. So here we can see on RSI that the RSI is going down, right? However, aha, uh -huh, at the same time we see that the candlesticks are actually going up. The RSI is showing that it's going down, RSI is making a high, lower highs, but the price is making higher highs. Okay, so the price and the RSI. The RSI tells us that it's going down, so the price is go, has this beautiful divergence and the RSI is, tell, is telling us, look, price is actually going down. So look for selling opportunities, even though candlesticks did go up. And what happened? The price went down because we had a beautiful divergence right here. Now, next one, uh, study risk management. Risk management, again, there's not much to study in risk management. For example, usually what we need to do, you don't want to invest more than 2% from your trading account into any one trade. And if you have a small trading account, you should never have more than five to six trades being open at the same time. Okay. Also, whenever you place the trade, make sure that you always know when to take the profits. Don't just let the profits run, then uh, you know, then wait too long, and then whenever the price reverses, you lose all your profits, and actually you can be and you can end up in losses. For example, if you if you place buy trade here, where you should take your profits, look at your support resistance. So this, for example, is our resistance. So when the price goes up here, you know that if it hits this level, it could retrace and it could fall. Therefore, if the price comes to this level, we take our money. And after we, what we take our money, what usually happens is, you know, the price falls or corrects. And but from after that point, we can plan our next trade. The next trade would be whenever it breaks this level on upside. Okay, we will make another buy and we make another profitable trade. In fact, I'm actually monitoring one of the uh, S&P 500 trades right here on my CFD broker. I'm making around uh, five and a half uh, thousand dollar profit from this one single trade. Uh, it's really, really volatile, but here you are, okay? Just one simple trade and in some of the, some of the you know, uh, not that developed countries, this could be like a monthly salary or something, okay? So it's quality or quantity. Uh, now, uh, now risk management talks about, so review fundamental literature. So remember that who is driving the markets is the, is, is the people, okay? Is the institutional investors, the institutions who trades, they are, you know, moving the markets. We as a, as, as a retail traders, if you put all of retail traders together, we only make around 20% of the whole volume. So please understand it, okay? So make sure you read the news. Go to any news websites. I, I, I use several, so this, uh, investing.com and so on, and read the news and see what's moving the markets and why. And the 12th day, okay? So in the 12th day, you must create your trading plan. And that's final, okay? Once you have created your trading plan, simply follow it from day to day basis. How to create a trading plan? I have made video on my channel. I will, it should pop up somewhere here on the top right hand side corner. Okay, this video right here, how to create a trading plan fast. So watch it and it's gonna, you know, help you. So now furthermore, okay, I'm not finished yet. Furthermore, so, okay, now furthermore, choose which type of trader you are, okay? If you're a day trader, swing trader, pattern trader, or momentum trader, or position. So now, quick, quick sneak peek, okay? So if you are a newbie trader and you're wondering, okay, 
Hey, I don't have that much time, you know, to study all of this thing. Okay, what would be the strategies, okay, that you can go out there and start, you know, practicing on a demo account first, okay? As you know, you should start with demo first and only then invest real money. You should trade with the demo account at least for two weeks. Two weeks, okay? And then if you're able to flip your demo account balance, only then you're ready to invest real money. Because when you invest real money, even $5, your mindset will change, okay? It will be different. So, um, yeah, so if I was going, if I was new with Trader, okay? These are the strategies that are really, really loved by fresh freshmen, by new traders, new with traders. They are trading with moving averages, and trading breakouts. There are many, many moving average trading strategies. Uh, so for example, let's go up here. One of the most popular, of course, is EMA 50 and EMA 200. Let's place it right here. Whenever EMA 50 crosses EMA 200, it's called a golden cross. So whenever that happens, we could look for buy opportunities. But I'll just make sure that we, you know, uh, to check the, uh, the larger time frames first and use smaller time frames to find best entries. And the breakouts, okay? And the breakouts, so of, of course, so the breakouts is, um, are my uh, favorite trading uh, approach, trading strategies. Look for the break, uh, so uh, place the trend lines on a chart, okay? Look for, the, look for the breakouts, and whenever breakout happens, for example, this is the resistance, very important. Whenever the breakout happens, whenever it breaks out of that key level, we place by, by you know, trade that direction and we make money on a move because we created this beforehand and we set the alerts and whenever price has hit or, uh, you know, or breakout target, we place the trade and we can be anywhere around the world and make money on a go by using this breakout trading strategy setup, for example. This is an automated trading system which you have created, you know, so you don't need to be a genius to do that. So just learn about breakouts, uh, okay? I have made many breakout strategy videos on my channel. Check them out or email me if you need help in trading. So thank you for watching this video. Like and subscribe. Thank you for subscribing to my channel, by the way. Stay safe, stay, uh, you know, trade responsibly, enjoy your profits, and yes, you know, uh, you can learn to day trade for a living quickly, okay, and, you know, really, if you can master that one trading strategy, you can become successful with that one strategy, and that one strategy you can use, you know, to trade all asset classes, and you can be become financially independent. I, I, I have taught how to do this, I have seen how people have achieved this, you know, and I've seen some people only learning in depth couple of trading strategies and they are, you know, they're earning more than their full time income. You know, they're earning more than they can actually, be, you know, believe that they could earn by simply using the same strategies every single day. Uh, and this is the thing, quality over quantity. So forget about learning all the training strategies, you know, because uh, many of them you can put out in a bin because many of them will not work because you're of your mindset. Everybody has different mindset. So look what works for you. Thank you for this video. Uh, I love you all. God bless and bye bye. So if you need any help in trading, you're welcome to contact me. Also visit my website, andrewstradingchannel.com and, uh, you know, read my blog and get your free books. I love you all. Bye bye.